I just uh, I just come into the shed in the morning and uh, I've been doing this record cleaning malarkey with uh, using the PVA glue using the uh, Yuhu PVA and here's one this is I don't this isn't the actual copy bike this is one of the first reggae singles I owned or I acquired it was Ride Your Donkey by the Tenors that's dated at 1968 so that's a very early piece but also I'm struck by the uh, the white splashes of PVA on here and it uh, brings to my mind a story I don't know whether I should repeat <laughs> but it's uh, There's this guy who uh, used to sit on the next desk to well, sit at the next desk to me at school and he used to tell me about his uh, masturbatory uh, adventures first thing in the morning. And he managed to land semen on his record deck once. It just sort of reminded me of that. He's now the principal of, uh, no, he's not a principal. He's now a head of department of an art school up north. I won't say which which art school is the uh, <laughs> is the head of department of, but uh, I did send him a, a message on Facebook and he's not got back to me. So if he doesn't get back to me, I'll name that particular art school, <laughs> and all his students can have a good laugh at him, can't they? Uh. That, that bloke from the Nocturnal Emissions has been told, telling me about you. <laughs> and your Nocturnal Emissions, or maybe they were Diurnal Emissions, I don't know. See, the thing is, I've done these, I've done the, I've got a sheet of newspaper down, but the thing is, when you turn them over and do the other side, you get little blobs, little blobs go through, you see, so you've got to clean it up again. <laughs> Get the bits of newspaper off the other side. But uh, it doesn't make this, it uh, sort of got rid of that sort of muffled sound. I suppose the thing is with vinyl, sound is physical. It has a, you know, it has a physical dimension. The, the grooves sort of expand. I think they go, the grooves in a record go that way and they go up and down and bounce, bounce a record up and down to uh, generate sound from uh, the stylus. These sort of analog processors. When they say that, uh, you know, a potter's wheel has probably got the same effect, so you might be able to pick up the sound of uh, Neolithic times from the grooves on a on a Neolithic pot. That's if they used wheels in those days. Maybe they did. Maybe they didn't. Maybe they did. Maybe they didn't. Going on like that, uh, yeah, maybe they did, maybe they didn't. I'm going on like that, uh, President of the United States that they had, whose name I can never remember. It was, uh, it was a, on that American version of The Apprentice. I've got to get you off my mind, the tenors. And you'll see here, the label's been scratched there. 